Question 91 from the CST Geometry Release Test Questions. In the circle shown below, the measure of arc PR is 140 degrees, and the measure of arc, oh, I'm sorry, of angle RPQ is 50 degrees. What is the measure of arc PQ? Well, in the previous problem, we discussed how uh, an arc takes exactly the same measure as the angle whose vertex intercepts that part of the arc. Uh, well, there's another one, there's another rule that says that an angle whose vertex lies on the circle, not on the center of the circle, but on the circle itself, that intercepts that arc has a measure of exactly half that arc. So that means then that angle uh, Q is 70 degrees, which is half of 140. And that means that the measure of arc RQ must be 100 degrees. Okay. By that same token, um, I know that the uh, number of degrees going all the way around a circle is 360. So if I add the 140 from arc RP, to the 100 degrees from arc um, RQ and then subtract the result 240 degrees from 360 degrees I'll get the measure of the other arc so 360 minus 240 is 120 degrees so that means that the measure of arc PQ is 120 degrees, which means that the measure of this angle R here should be half of that, or 60 degrees. Let's double check our work. If I add 60 plus 50 plus 70 degrees, they should equal the total for the sum of the angles in a triangle, which should be 180. And indeed, I get 180 degrees. And I also get 360 degrees around the outside of the circle. So what is the measure of arc PQ? Uh, we determine that to be 120 degrees. Answer D.